power of levels and analysis yet again yesterday i had mentioned that it is delivering lower highs and do not treat this as bullish do not buy gold unless and until it breaks past 2175.76 while at the same time a selling entry 2168 uh, 64 zone can be taken uh, below 2168 we can look forward to 62 64 and then 54 56 it has precisely beautifully respected the levels it has breached in fact further below towards 2052 2152 and bounce back now what to expect from gold as it is consolidating its position delivering higher lows and lower highs can we expect it to stay in the zone can we expect it to or uh, we can expect it to give a breakout what is going to be our strategy in order to profit trading gold today we will be seeing with the help of charts and indicators towards the end of this update i'll be sharing the trading strategy for the day watch this is the first update for the day next update will be released before the us session watch that as well thus subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get the notifications or join the free telegram channel for live market updates all the links are there in the channel and video description and also do join the channel memberships here on youtube and support the effort now first let's have a look at the early charts on the early charts we can clearly see gold is consolidating its position and you can see beautifully higher lows are getting created at the same time lower highs are also seen here thus it is to be said or it can be concluded that it is trying to consolidate unless and until we see a break below 2150 2148 zone we should not be treating this as a breakout on the downside while 2180 on the upside is going to be the breakout consideration now if you look at the movement after the drop this is again a retracement i will treat this as a retracement and yes this can be considered for a reversal staying above 21 70 71.5 zone right now i can see see the slope here is sharp it is a gradual rise thus it can be considered as a retracement now look at the early charts in more detail you will find rise retracement rise again higher highs higher lows so in fact if you track it on the minor time frame see this is sharp now this is traded sideways and i can say it is still running bullish yes you can sell here at 2160 levels but look at this consolidation zone 2160 2157 58 this is going to be a very very stronger support zone or rather yes below this is where we can say now the bears will try to take over and then in fact we can look forward to see first thing is higher lows which means 2154 levels again should come into picture and then only we can say that it is turning bearish towards 2150 so in sum to say very very good support is seen here as long as it stays about 2150 levels now on the upside see it is trying to stay bullish higher highs higher lows and thus a buying entry i will recommend is only and only if you see it is staying about 2168 when the lower prices is above 2168 we can expect it to rise more but let's have a further detail look magd uh, is exponential moving averages are trading with divergence and bearishness right now the stock is rising magd is also rising see uh, you can see what we have seen on the charts is reflected here and after the drop this is rise this is retracement and it ag again rising so more bullishness can be expected rsi flat coming to two likewise on the two hour chart see one can take it as the prices are divergent from the 2050 period moving average it has come to take the test at 21 or 20 period moving average here and in fact we can see it hitting the median of the bollinger bands thus 2168 should be watched out for this is definitely going to be a good resistance zone for gold as of now till as long as it stays below 2168 stock has stick rising magd is trying to convert crossover for a buying entry rsi staying flat coming to three hour look at the three hour charts consolidation and you can see first bullish candle so i will wait for the next candle and once you see it is staying above 2168 you can consider that it is trying to deliver higher highs from here possibility is there but uh, we have to look forward to see first yes if you're buying at 2168 you have to be very very cautious at alert at, at around 2174 76 zone this is going to be a stronger resistance zone and if and only if gold is seen trading about 2174.76, we can say now it is trying to turn bullish here. A stock is rising. MACD is also trying to converge crossover. RSI is rising, coming to 4R. Likewise, on the 4R charts, after the drop, prices have again converged towards the 20 period moving average and towards the median of the Bollinger Bands. Now, look at these two candles. See, first of all, uh, a bullish candle, then a retracement candle, then again a bullish candle, and see the body sizes here. You can see diminishing body size that is first observation so current candle this time frame is going to remain important 
And if we see it heading higher, we can expect that it is the beginning of a further rise as long as it stays below 21.74.75. We, we should not be treating this as a reversal. It has to break this zone. And this is going to be a difficult task for gold for the day it appears. Moving averages have started to converge here. The stochastic rising, MACD is also trying to converge, RSI is flat, coming to daily. Before we look into daily charts and I share the strategy for the day, if you want to learn this art of trading, you can be part of my 30th mentorship batch starting first week of April. Register yourself now. Equip yourself with the tools and strategies and uh, concepts which can help you identify profitable trades with ease. And the trade setups which I teach are going to help you trade profitably. So do not miss this opportunity. Invest in your learning first. Reach out to me via Telegram or email for more details. As you can just be part of my signals channel on Telegram. We are trading as per the signals you can benefit. Again, write an email or ping me on Telegram for details related to the services. And many of you have asked me to recommend a broker which is safe, secure with global presence where the transactions are easier, where the which offers a swap free account with the lowest spreads. You can find the recommended broker link in the channel and video description. I trade in the same with the same broker and that is why I can recommend now. Now, if you look at the daily chart, see as you have seen on the daily charts, a reversal sign was seen since then we are seeing lower highs and higher lows zone of consolidation here. And thus it is very, very important for gold to now come out of this. Now, which direction it may come? If you look at the candle here, bigger bearish candle, uh, swing candle here or retracement candle, then a moderate bearish candle. So here it tried to reverse, but the size of the candle is comparatively much lesser. It suggests that the bearishness has diminished. Now, second thing is only and only if, because see, it has started on a flat note, if it reverses below 2160, and then if you see it breaking below 2150, you can say a sharper drop can be expected and this time, gold may try to move towards 2140 2130 zone as well see prices are trading with too much of divergence from the 20 period moving average and the median of the bollinger band sitting at around 2120 21 uh 2110 levels here stock i has dropped as well MACD. see MACD was trading with extreme uh divergence it has started to converge it is not yet crossed over rsi is still just coming out of the overbought zone so it appears that later in the gold may try to reverse however i will still not say that it is bearish as long as 2150 is respected today looking at this i will only recommend you to sell here at 2160 58 zone wait for it to break below 54 52 zone and then 2148 levels if it breaks below this directly we are looking at 2140 as the next targets below 2140 there is a sharper fall which can be expected and as i have shared earlier as long as 2150 is not breached, 2150 48 is not breached, you should not be treating gold as bearish. So, yes, you can take a sell entry at around 2158 60 zone and expect it to trade with slight drop. Be careful at around 52 54 and then 48 50. Yes, very, very good support are seen here. Now, on the buy side, you can buy here at 2168 70 zone. But be watchful at around 74.75 if and only if gold trades above 74.75. We can say slight bullishness will be seen and then we can look forward to 21.80, 21.85. Beyond 21.85, the sky is the limit. Gold is not going to look back from there. Take your positions accordingly. Like, share, subscribe and comment. Do watch the next update before the US session. Thus press the bell icon. Thank you. Have a great profitable trading day.